For a child, the library can be a magical place. I'm officially the most awesome girl in the world. It can transform you academically, but it can also nurture you emotionally. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm excited. This is going to be our nicest library by far. <laughs> what people don't realize is that school libraries are sometimes not funded at all. We'll be full of books over here. This results in schools with outdated collections, books from the 50s, sometimes even the 30s. This only happens because we all work together. We provide libraries for underserved communities and schools. Right. Our whole goal is to spread literacy and the benefits of literacy. We rely on two groups. We rely on donors, and with that donor money, we buy brand new high interest books and we catalog them ourselves, so the cost is very low. It's about 70% off list price. And then we rely on volunteers to give gently used donated books. We don't just come in and give you books. So you ready? The community comes to help and the kids come and help. We paint murals in the library that are reflective of what the school wants and books that they've read. So it's really warm and welcoming. High five! We really transform it. It's perfect. When the kids come back and they see their library, they're completely amazed at how beautiful the space looks. And they really get this sense that, wow, I'm important. And this space is important. <laughs> Three to 4,000 books came in. So that's, that's life changing. That's just a powerful experience for the students. You're clearly a genius. We've helped over 300 libraries. Yay, books! And we've done 40 community libraries, which means they're at a homeless shelter or a battered woman shelter. We've distributed over one and a half million books. I want kids to love reading. Under his breath. Reading opens up a whole new world. You learn vocabulary, you learn to problem solve, and before you know it, you know how to navigate things in life. Really, the core of it all is books. Read!